June the 18th. Prepared and active. Let faith find us. Prepared and active. Here is the great soul. The one, the one, surrender, the one, the one who surrenders to fate. The opposite is the weak and the generous one who struggles with and has a poor regard for the order of the world and seeks to correct the faults of the gods rather than their own. Seneca, Moral Letters, 107.12. Prepared and active. Let fate find us prepared and active. Here is a great soul, the one who surrenders to fate. The opposite is the weak and the degenerous one who struggles with and has a poor regard for the order of the world and seeks to correct the faults of the gods rather than their own. Whatever happens today, let it find us prepared and ready for problems, ready for difficulties, ready for people to behave in a disappointing or confusing way, confusing ways, ready to accept and make it work for us. Let's not wish we could turn back time and make the universe according to our preference. Not when it would be far better and far easier to make our to make ourselves to remake ourselves. So we have this belief that the universe needs correcting This is a source of it. Where, where, is, where are these beliefs coming from that the universe needs remaking, needs changing? Let change happen. Be prepared for change. Surrender, surrender to fate rather than be the generous one who struggles with it. Struggles, surrender to fate rather than struggle with it. Become aware of our regard for the world and seek, the, seek, the, seek to correct the faults of our own rather than rather than what we believe, rather than others in the world. The world is doing fine. The world, the universe doesn't need your help. The world, the universe has got it under control. It doesn't need correcting. The more we disagree with that, that no, the world, needs my help and I can change the world and these beliefs of it's me, I'm, I'm, the, I'm, I'm the powerful one, I can do this. And it comes from a, a good place. Oh, we all have a good place inside us and we're all attempting to change the world because we think the only, if, the only reason we would do that is we have a belief that the world is not running the card to how it should. But in our perspective, in our perception and perspective, and according to, according to our beliefs, that should be different. But we all have 
thousands of thousands of beliefs I and mean, there's billions of people in the world so there's not one belief just because you believe something should happen doesn't mean that everyone would agree that should happen so we so it's far easier to just focus on our own focus on the our choices focus on our responses focus on what we can change about ourselves with this belief that if i ch if i change that thing outside of me then i'll change inside this is a lack of awareness this is the confusion this is the this is the shift of ah the realization of ah if i change something inside of me then something will as a, as a byproduct the universe will change according to that so the more we go within and seek to remake ourselves reborn we you know disassemble the beliefs and you know and, and feel this wisdom of seneca these great leaders seneca great philosophers seneca marcus Aurelius, or who, whichever books you read the more we sort of um leave the universe leave fate to do what it needs to do and be prepared for whatever comes whatever's thrown at us then the more we're sort of in the alignment of ah this this being this the, the universe was ah this being is 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 taking a step back it's leaving me it's, it's starting, starting to trust and have faith that everything that is happening is 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 is, is working out even though we may see not feel it is and then peace will fall peace and love so today as Ryan Holiday mentions in this chapter, we're going to be ready for difficulties, ready for problems, ready to ready to ready to draw a perspective of things we find confusing in other people and other things. And contemplate what can it how can we work? How can it work for us? And that constant remaking of ourselves rather than remaking out there. Remaking our own behaviors. You choose. Enjoy your day.